Lovely one, this is my son Owens. Um, doing a little tutorial for one of my songs, Girl from Up Yeah, This is for the Flurry as well, so yeah, hopefully, uh, if you're into the songs, it'll be out on Spotify soon. Uh, this is how we play it anyway, so go something like this. Of the song, it's also the chorus as well. It's dead easy, there's only four chords in it. Um, so you're starting off with the D chord, but you're keeping the high string open, so don't have no fingers on the high string. That's for all these chords as well. So you play it open, you've got that nice ring out there. Yeah. So, yeah, so you go with D and then you just strum it like this. strumming pattern there. That's for all the chords and that as well. So the, you're playing your D. After that you go to the F sharp minor, open. You, you, know, you don't play it like the bar chord, you play it like that. F sharp, F sharp minor, open. And you move on to your A, and you're playing that open as well. So you keep the B string open. I think it's a nice sus chord. Then your last chord just your standard D. So if you put them all together, you should sound like this. That's the start of the song, so also the chorus as well. Then uh, you'll move on to the verse, and it's the same chords, just in a different order. So instead of doing D, F sharp minor, A, D, you're doing D, A, F sharp minor, to E. So same chords, you just swap the A and the F sharp minor around. And you play it as well. Same rhythm, but you're just palm muting it as well. You're not playing it as hard, you know. So. Well, when you're playing that uh, the verse, it's good to get the uh, the low bass notes in the F sharp minor. You know, instead of playing it open in the chorus, give it a bit more of a you know a bassy effect when you're playing. You know, chugging along. But yeah, so that's the verse. Play it once more. like a little riff bit here and uh, it's basically over the same chords as the chorus so D, F sharp, minor, A, E but you're playing it like this and you're throwing a little riff in now um, so still over the, uh, the chorus chords D, F sharp, minor, A, E but you're doing this little riff here up here instead so it's a bit easier to play. Yeah so yeah that's what you're doing here so that's 
the little riff bit there. After you've done the riff, after the second chorus, you go into the bridge. Bridge is just easy as well, just um, another little four chord pattern. So, do this twice. You go into the, uh, the bridge, starts on the B minor. Slower there, so there's the chords you're doing, similar strumming pattern, but you're going on your B minor, G F sharp minor, C A, D, C E. Do it again, B minor. The second time round, you'll stop on the E chord, and then you'll go into like one of these little. Yeah. yeah, and you'll go, she knows the score. Then you'll go back into the chorus again, um, play the, uh, the same as the intro, like a bit, a bit softer. at the end and then at the end just go for it and just smash each other in, you know what I mean? But yeah, that was your girl from Fashakli anyway. Uh, hopefully it helps you if you want to learn. It's not too hard. The little riff might be a bit difficult but you don't even have to play it. Just make it your own anyway. Nice one uh, for listening. Uh, get on this for more.